Okay, in this video I'm going to demonstrate how you can connect your calendar from your school collaboration site to your Outlook. Uh, first of all, I'm going to show you that I do not have any calendars on my Outlook um, except for my personal one. Okay, so to start out, go to your home page of your school collaboration site and I want you to click on school calendar. When this page loads, all you have to do is click on the calendar tab and this is the button that you're going to click the one that says connect to outlook now if it's grayed out like it is on here all you have to do is press the f5 key on your keyboard to refresh the page once the page refreshes click again on the calendar tab and now you'll see that you're able to cut uh, to click on the button uh, so go ahead and click on it and now you're going to get this uh, box here asking you if you want to allow this website to open up a program um, this will open up Outlook whether it's running already or if it's not. So go ahead and click allow. And once you do that, you'll see that Outlook will open up and you're going to be prompted with this question asking you if you want to connect this calendar to Outlook. So go ahead and uh, click yes. And now you see that you have two calendars on here. Uh, if you do not see it displayed here on the uh, options for calendars, go ahead and click on mail and go back to calendar and now you'll see that the calendar is now listed under other calendars uh, so now to uh, click and or to add events all you have to do is click and drag events over and they're going to automatically go to the date and uh, carry over all the information uh, so if you go back to your SharePoint page and hit F5 again to refresh it you'll see that now you have three events uh, this works vice versa so if you have any events on your calendar uh, on SharePoint that maybe somebody else has created and you want to copy those to your personal calendar you're able to copy you know click and drag the events over to your personal calendar